InstaWeather Plus forecast with Chief Meteorologist Tom Tasselmeyer. Another beautiful spring day across the region with temperatures running warmer than normal, that's for sure. Uh, most areas made it to the low 80s, at least briefly before a front made its way through the region. Current temperatures around the metro uh, range from the upper 60s in Jarrettsville and Rising Sun and Stewartstown up in southern PA to the uh, mid 70s now. Rock Hall, Centerville, Ridgely on the eastern shore. Columbia still at 75 degrees across our region. And there is some cooler air to the north of us beginning to sneak back in. So tomorrow probably won't be quite as warm, but La Plata still at 80. Patuxent Naval Air Station 80. Salisbury right now 81 degrees. But the winds have turned to the north. And again, that's that weak front coming down the coast. Didn't do much in the way of producing precipitation. We had a little cloud cover, some gusty winds with the passage of that backdoor front coming down out of New England, down the coast. Most of our fronts come in across the mountains from the west, but the back door front is the one that comes down out of New England and behind it, those winds gusting to 30 miles an hour at Ocean City right now. I'm still at a gust to 21 at BWI Marshall, but again, it's very hard to find any kind of rain in that cloud cover, very dry front coming through. There were some showers up in southern New England, moving off Cape Cod out to sea and a couple sprinkles and showers off to the west of us, but our real next best chance for rain holds off until Thursday night or Friday. So a couple more days of beautiful spring weather to enjoy. 81 in Charleston now, 83 in Richmond, 86 down near the North Carolina line around Danville, Virginia, but only 62 in Scranton, 58 in Buffalo. And how about Boston? They're a chilly 48 now. That's where the air is coming from. So cooler weather on the way. Maybe the only little wrinkle in this perfect weather pattern is the high, very high pollen counts. Tree pollen went up even higher today. Yesterday, it was about 2,200. We added 1,500 to that, up to 3,752 for the tree pollen count. If you suffer from tree pollen allergies, you're probably really feeling it. Grass and weed pollen also very high, and the mold count is up there as well. So, yeah, it's beautiful spring weather, but that means lots of pollen in the atmosphere. Clearing and cooler tonight will drop into the 40s, which is normal. Winds out of the north at 5 to 10 miles an hour. High pressure sitting up to the north of us will be pushing down that cooler air for at least a day or so. And then the western system that's been causing all the headlines from snow in Denver to flooding rains in Houston. It's now making its way slowly through the Mississippi River Valley. The core of this heads through the Great Lakes and into eastern Canada, but the trailing front will slide across our area on Friday, bringing us our best chance for rain, best chance for rain we've had in quite some time, and we actually need it. Sunny skies on Wednesday, slightly cooler. Clouds increasing on Thursday. Most of the showers stay in the mountains to our north and west during the day, but late Thursday night and certainly into Friday, we pick up the chance for showers, and uh, there's even a minimal chance of a thunderstorm or two embedded in that, but mostly just spring showers for the end of the week. Sunny tomorrow, 66 to 71. The winds out of the north shifting to the southeast during the afternoon. The bay forecast calls for those light east or southeast way, uh, winds. Waves right around a foot. Water temperatures now in the upper 50s to low 60s across the central and upper parts of the bay. 68 in the mountains tomorrow. Showers are likely in western Maryland Thursday, but that rain doesn't reach us until later Thursday night or Friday. So enjoy a couple more nice days on the eastern shore. Very comfortable upper 60s to low 70s and slightly cooler at Ocean City. Seven day forecast for Baltimore then. 68 tomorrow and 70 Thursday. Showers are likely Friday, 75 degrees. Partly cloudy, a little cooler, but very nice for the weekend. Highs on Saturday and Sunday in the upper 60s. All right, there.